Well, it certainly felt like a spring, spring day today, and the UNH baseball team, well, they're already in North Carolina where they're open their season tomorrow. Another baseball news, Cleveland Indians have signed veteran infielder Juan Uribe. He's expected to challenge for the third base starting job. Austin Scott always ready to get outside, and he stops in now with our Layfeld Welding Top 5 Plays of the Week. I'm sure Klondike has given two paws up for the season the ONU women are having. Last Saturday afternoon, the Polar Bears beat Muskegon 68-53 behind 15 points from Carly Thomas to claim the outright OAC regular season championship. Another conference champion gets crowned at number four. For the first time in school history in any sport, the Lima Senior Spartans are Three Rivers Athletic Conference champions. Thanks to 30 points from Xavier Simpson, the Spartans defeated Toledo Central Catholic 85-50 to claim the outright track title. It didn't come easy for Lincoln View at number three, but they got the job done. Ada took the Lancers down to the wire last Friday night, but it was Lincoln View winning 49-47 to claim their first Northwest Conference Championship since 1997. And of course we have a spot reserved on the countdown for Andy Brunette. Last Saturday night against Wapak, Brunette gets a pass on the baseline and makes this one-handed flush look way too easy. I'm sure Mark Shine is proud of the fundamentals the Crestview Knights show on this week's top play. Check out Cody Mefford's bounce pass from beyond half court to a driving Drew Klein and the reverse finish is just as pretty as the pass. We can't wait to start counting down the best plays from this postseason, and it wouldn't be possible without the help from Layfeld Welding on the top five plays of the week. 